This is Lake Las Vegas, an oasis in the desert. This is Stacy, and this is the Hydrofoiler XE1. It's an electric bike that you pedal on the water. Of course it is. As you pedal, the electric motor turns the propeller which pulls you forward and the hydrofoils underneath act like aircraft wings and lift the whole caboodle out of the water. It's the same sort of thing you might have seen on racing yachts. Well, it looks manageable, doesn't it? I mean, how hard can it be, really? And as long as you pedal hard enough at the start, you can get the lift you need and you are sailing. They said you want to go for a bike ride in Las Vegas. So I said, yeah, why not? They also said, do you want to go for a trip on Lake Las Vegas? I realized they meant at the same time. Ah! And here's the problem. Until you get the hang of it, there's quite a bit of this. And this. And this. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh! The trick, apparently, is if you feel the bike start to overbalance, steer into the tilt, but lean the other way. And when that doesn't work, try not to swear on camera. Now, I was hoping to show you more of my successful rides, but you've already seen all of them before the winter water temperatures got the better of me. So please watch Stacy being too cool for school while I tell you that experienced riders can get up to 13 miles an hour. The battery gives you an hour of ride time and the price is nearly seven and a half thousand dollars. So if you buy one, find some warmer water and practice, practice, practice. She makes it look so easy. I nearly had it, I swear I nearly had it. <laughs> I just need a couple more goes, but right now I'm absolutely frozen.